This year, nearly 16,000 children will be diagnosed with some form of cancer in the U.S. Many of those kids will miss a considerable amount of school while they battle the disease. So how do classmates stay connected to a student who can't be there with them? As Team 12's Nicole Zymick shows us, one program has a solution and it's helping students right here in the Valley. In Ms. Carlos's second grade class at Brett Tarver Elementary, today is a normal day. After you are done writing, you may cut it out, you may color it lightly. The students are working on a special writing project, an assignment to reach out to one student who can't be here. I have never experienced this before. This is a new experience for me, so I am a learning as well as the children are learning. And we both are doing a great job with coping with this situation and we're learning from it. We're growing from it. You're make, uh, what color are you going to make your cupcake? While her classmates are at school, Audrey Lopez has a different assignment, a much harder one. Her job is to get better. They found a, a brain tumor, a tumor in her brain. With surgery and radiation behind her, Audrey now must undergo chemotherapy. It's, it's going good. Um, some days are better than others. And although Audrey missed all of Miss Carlos's second grade this year, her classmates have a unique way of keeping her close. And remember, we're going to give them to Charlie because Charlie is Audrey. Charlie is our Audrey. This is Charlie, a sort of stand in for Audrey while she's away. The purpose is for the students to be aware of the situation that Audrey's in, and it's also to teach them kindness and careness and responsibility. They are in charge of taking care of Charlie all day long, and it's a great program. The letters that Ms. Carlos's students are writing, letters of encouragement to Audrey, will be sent home in Charlie's backpack. Dear Audrey, hi Audrey, I hope you feel better soon. I was in your first grade class. Do you remember me? You are the best. And Audrey has a message for her classmates as well. I miss them very much and I can't wait to go back. Until she can go back, Charlie will hold her spot and help her friends support the little girl bravely fighting a big disease. Nicole Zymek, 12 News.